Okay, so the third part is where we get to practice the hand motions. So we still are practicing a 3-4 time and a 4-4 time, but instead of using those numbers, do you remember we have different hand motions? So that's why I'm in my kitchen today, is so that I can just mix them all around and use this magnet board. All right, so you guys ready? I'm gonna mix them up. Let's see. All right, so the first one is going to be lap. So slap your lap. Second one is snap. Third one is thumbs. So we put them behind, thumbs. And then the fourth one will be clap. But you remember we have a pattern that sometimes goes one, two, three, one, two, three, and sometimes a pattern that goes one, two, three, four. So I'm gonna turn clap over until we're ready to use it. So now you can practice singing the iron rod. Practice along with me. I will probably mess up, but you do it at home, okay? You ready? Here we go. So it's our one, two, three pattern. One, two, three, one, two. Let's start our pattern on the word Levi. One, two. Two, So for the second verse, let's try it again. Second verse with new hand motions. Good job, now we're gonna mix it up for the third verse. Let's switch these, and switch these, and we'll turn that one over. Okay, third verse. for my brain and that's hard when they put that little pause in there but I hope you had a fun time reviewing the iron rod and if you want to read that story with your family that would be a great review too so remember the iron rod is much stronger than my cardboard rod hold to the rod the iron rod it's a strong and bright and true bye you guys <laughs>